y'all. Um, I'd like to start out with saying I'm a new in fly fishing, but working. I'm going to show you my top five flies so far. So, yay. This fish pond sand one bag is really cool. It comes with this piece to put your flies on. So, let's start out with that. Let me see here. I do not know what many of these are called. Um, here we have just like a yellow and orange piece of hair with a gold eye. This works pretty good for bluegills and small bass. So next one I would say is... Now I don't think this is a woolly booger. Right here. Hold on. Let me get this out. I don't think this is a woolly booger, but it might be. It's green and black. So. That's my set, my fourth best fly. Next best fly would probably be the these ants, right? I guess they're ants. I don't really know. I do know that I do not have a copper John right now, but that honorable mention. But there is that. I have three of those. So that was fly number three. Now number two, I do know what these are called. Woolly peppers. Preferably in the olive color or white and black, of course. So stand by, but the old woolly booger is I don't know why with the gold head that's just awesome so that's that an honorable mention to these these are like little wormy squirmy things as you can see them right there those little pink things yeah they work okay alrighty for my favorite fly this little grasshopper. I don't know what it is about this thing, but it's so lace. Trout, bass, bluegill, anything that hits, <laughs> likes this. So, anything that eats a grasshopper. Got some red there. I usually put some, I'm not, I usually put some, sorry about that, it's up here. Some of this floating stuff on it. I mean, I'd rather have and not need than the need and not have. That's what I say. Thank you for watching this video, and tomorrow I will be making a video on what's inside this bad boy. And until next time, God bless. See ya.